now we're going to talk about the present subjunctive and using the verb querer. So the verb querer, as we already saw, can be used with no subject change to say things that the subject wants to do. So for example, um, yo quiero visitar Peru algún día. Uh, that's pretty straightforward. It's just I want to visit Peru someday. Um, so again, that format is just quiero. So that's just the indicative form of, of querer, conjugated for the, the subject, which is I. Visitar, so that's the infinitive, and then um, whatever else follows in that sentence. So quiero visitar Peru, pretty straightforward. Another one uh, example of this is Pablo no quiere comer ensalada para el almuerzo. So again, it's Pablo who doesn't want to, want to eat salad. He's the subject for both of these. He doesn't want to eat. He doesn't want to eat the salad. Um, now, if there's a change in subject, so if it's I want you to do something or I want you to not do something, um, then then there's a change in subject because it's I then you changing the subject. So let's take a look at these two. Quiero que me visites algún día. This one we are using the subjunctive because there is a change in subject. Yo quiero, so in that first part, I'm the subject, que me visites. In that second part, you're the subject, visitar. So I want you to visit me. Quiero que me visites. Um, and again, visitar would usually have an AR ending for the indicative, but since it's subjunctive, it's ES, visites. Quiero que me visites algún día, using the subjunctive. Another example, the, in the first part, the subject is we, and in the second, it's ustedes. So it's, again, a change of subject. Queremos que ustedes se queden otro día. We want you to stay another day. So, again, the, the construction here is something um, more similar to I want that you might visit someday. Uh, some, something like that. It doesn't sound right in English, so that's um, part of the challenge behind subjunctive, but that's more or less the, the literal translation. And you'll notice that most subjunctive uses have this special word que, and this is no exception. Quiero que me visites algún día. That, that, that word that, que, is almost always used for subjunctive. Queremos que, again, another que, ustedes se queden otro día. And again, quedar becomes que then because it's subjunctive. So that's just a few examples of querer. Again, with no subject change, we use the infinitive. With subject change, we use the subjunctive.